I probably got my first pair of Vandals when I was like 15, but I was also a little bit of an early adopter to the sneaker craze. I wouldn't say like I was really heavy into Vandals at that time, but then once Dunks started to grip their talons into the masses, that was when I got really into the Vandals, and that was probably in like the year 2000. I was in Tokyo and there was a typhoon that was like starting to roll in and I was sitting outside in a cafe with Fraser Cook and we were just talking about culture and talking about projects and I told him that I really wanted to work on the Vandal and how much that represented me in my personal style and he immediately was like, let's do it, I love the Vandal. <laughs> I was like, really? <laughs> okay. Just like that, that was, that's how it started. This version of the Vandal, it has our DNA, meaning that it's like our silhouette. Still has the leather tongue, folded seams, beautiful materials. Without compromising the original design, we were able to incorporate materials that are represented in the collection into the actual shoe. You'll notice that the corduroy, which is on the brown version, is from Italy, and on the teal version is from Japan, is the exact same corduroy that's in the collection. The straps were sourced by us. Last time, Nike did the entire silhouette. This time, it was like more of us coming together and um, utilizing like both of our sourcing abilities to craft the shoe. The thing that I love about the Vandal so much is that it's more the type of thing that you learn to love and you can rely on it and you can wear it every single day. It's really a reflection of my personality and my, my taste. I didn't know that I was going to fall in love with that silhouette like when I first saw it, but then once you start wearing it all the time, you can't really live without it. At least I couldn't. Working with Nike has been amazing. 2018 is gonna be our biggest Nike year to date. And um, being a lifelong swoosher, a kid that was literally drawing shoes when I was eight years old and sending them to Nike, to now look at this, the calendar and look how many shoes we're gonna drop with them this year. Um, it's exciting, you know, like to be able to have the chance to like reappropriate a little bit of their heritage for, for my, line like it's it's a dream come true. Mm -hmm.